Okay, everybody, I just came from the gym. I took a shower, a long, 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 good, good, good shower, exfoliated all my 2,000 parts. I'm getting ready to go to the place where uh, I'm gonna take my water tank and see if they can add some holes and fixtures to it. So it's going on 2 p.m. It's Monday and it's later than I wanted it to be. But I took my time in my shower. I did a video earlier today so when you have several YouTube channels and you're constantly doing multiple things, things don't go as fast as you want them to go. So I'm about to go and drive to the place and uh, I'll see y'all later. My window is very smudgy in spots because at night it gets so much moisture in here or when it gets cold or rain, it gets so much moisture and condensation in the inside and it dries on my window and it spots it up. So if I turn y'all around when I'm driving and you see spots on the window, that's cause of all that water and condensation that be up in here. It be a lot, y'all. Okay, let's go. place. I got this out the van. I'm waiting on my guy to come out and tell me what we're going to do with this thing. Uh-huh. They working, y'all. It's a shop. Okay, y'all. I am leaving the place where they just uh, fix the thing for the tank. They would not put the hole in the top. It's hot today, so I don't need this heater on. They would not put the hole in the top for me because they don't know what kind of plastic this is. I'm trying to back up out of here, y'all. this is and they don't want to damage it they don't want to take responsibility for it so I'm gonna have to figure it out and do it myself so I'm trying to see I need some more of that uh caulking putty stuff that I used for the top of the van for my vent fan I need some more of that so I might go to this store the RV store that we had went to We're gonna be right. 
riding. I got to go on another side of town right now. So let's go ride on another side of town. I just made it to the other place that I was headed to and I was going to stay on this side of town after I leave here but I forgot I need to do something on the other side of town so I might have to go back over there and so I'm going to go in here and I'm going to get two of those containers of uh, uh, this stuff, the tube of stuff, the caulking stuff for the travel trailers. I don't know what they call it, but I'm gonna get two tubes of that and then we're gonna head back on the other side of town so we can work on the van. I forgot I needed to do something over on that side of town, so um. I'm not gonna be able to stay on this side of town today. I think that caulking stuff was somewhere over here the last time I came here. I think there it is right there. So that, I think this is it. It was two different kinds. Self-leveling sealant self-leveling white and what's the difference RV roof expert white roof replacement roof replacement products RV I don't know what the difference is, so I'm going to have to ask them what the difference is. I want to show y'all where the people tried to break in the car the other day, how they loosened this thing up. They was trying to break in here, and look, they loosened it up, y'all. Y'all see that? So I'm going to have to get these locks changed on here because they was prying with it probably with a screwdriver or something and okay, loosened it up. The sealant that I wanted uh, they said it's not going to uh, adhere to the plastic that I have so they told me it's not going to work. Uh, they told me to go to an Ace Hardware or a Home Depot. Well, they said Ace Hardware, but I could go to Home Depot too. They told me to get a cement sealant that it adhere to that plastic. So, that's what I'm gonna try to do. Uh, hopefully, I can get everything I need today. And get it done. I think I'm just gonna head back over on the other side of town. And since I got to go back on the other side of town anyway, Somebody said they have good 
food too. So y'all let me know if y'all eaten at Stripes before and if y'all eaten at Crate and Barrel. Um, I'm on another side of town right now, but I'm not going to stay on this side of town. But the next time, I am going to come on this side of town soon. So next time, I'm on this side of town. Okay, you guys, I'm at Home Depot looking for this sealant that I need. And I am going to um, look also while I'm in here for some, uh, let me bring one of these baskets in. I'm gonna also look for some, uh, some, wood trimming because I want to change out that wood around the uh, my sink area thing. I want to change that wood out so I'm looking for some wood trimming. I want to get rid of that particle board. So I'm going to go in here. They probably going to be playing music so I'm probably going to have y'all on mute after this.
say, y'all, just this little stuff in the basket is $33. Woohoo! $33. I bought this piece of wood. I like finding wood for free. But we ain't found no wood for free lately, so. And I bought a little paint, some little nails to hammer it in. And then hopefully we can work on our DIY project today. And get it over with. Get that tank out of the van. I parked way back here because the man at Break Check watching my van for me while they work. Yeah. Sometimes you got to get other people to look out for you. Mm-hmm. 